Hello friends, we proved that set of real numbers is uncountable by assuming two lemmas. We proved the first lemma in the previous video. Now we prove the second lemma which says that any set with an uncountable subset is uncountable. Okay, let's look at the statement once more. It says that any set with an uncountable subset is uncountable. Okay, so let's start the proof. Let A be a set and B be a subset of A where B is an uncountable set. We have to prove that A is uncountable. In another words, we can write this way. If a set A has an uncountable subset B, then A is uncountable. We have to prove this and then using our universal generalization, we can conclude that any set with an uncountable subset is uncountable. Okay, let's see how we are going to prove the statement. If a set A has an uncountable subset B, then A is uncountable. We are going to prove this using proof by contradiction method. So using that we assume the negation of the statement first, right? So the statement here is of the format P implies Q and negation of P implies Q is nothing but P and not Q. We assume the hypothesis is true and the conclusion is false. Okay. So here we suppose that A is a set which has an uncountable subset B and that A is not an uncountable set but a countable set. Okay, now after our assumption, we know these things. A is a countable set and B is a subset of A and B is uncountable set. These are the things that we know. Okay, now since we know that A is a countable set, we know that any subset of A is a countable set. Because any subset of a countable set is countable. We have proved this statement in our previous video. I will give the link of that video in the description. You can watch that. Now here, since A is a countable set and B is subset of A, we get that B is a countable set. Now here B is uncountable and B is countable set. These two together contradicts, right? So this is a contradiction here. So meaning that our assumption was wrong. What do we assume? We assume the negation of the statement. So assume the negation of the statement and that is false statement. Now meaning that our statement is a true statement. So if a set A has an uncountable subset B, then A is uncountable is a true statement. And then using universal generalization, we can conclude that any set with an uncountable subset is an uncountable set.